Hello all, welcome back to our channel. So in this video, we are going to discuss about the semester 3 English quick revision because many of the students have having lots and lots of doubt regarding this uh, paper presentation and the pattern. So now we will discuss in this about the video. Previously, I have already done an important questions video as well as the paper presentation video. In this video, I will not at all discuss anything about that. I will give a quick revision about the English subject which you are having in your semester 3 of Usmania University. Because as your syllabus has been changed, we can't predict the question paper ma. And uh, coming back to the summaries, prose, poem, whatever you are having, vocabulary, grammar, spelling and the uh, punctuation, pronunciation, not punctuation, pronunciation. These are all you need to prepare it. Okay. So. And another thing, important thing is minimum three sites you need to attempt uh, for long part B. And part A, you will get the uh, uh, grammar bits, right? Okay. And also many of the students are getting doubt means how you should write that summaries, whether we should keep the side headings like introduction about the author like that. No need to do that. Uh, I have already done a preparation we paper presentation on the preparation video. Please watch that. You will get a clarity about this subject. Okay. But in this video, we will discuss mostly about the question paper pattern and the quick revision about the subject. Now. Okay. Hope you all will uh, watch this video. Watch this video fully. Then you will easily get the clarity about this subject. Okay. So now let's get into the video students. Okay. See. Students, this year your syllabus has been changed, right? We don't know whether how the question paper pattern will be, how the model paper will be. Some of them are saying in CR material, they're asking from short questions. In some of them, they are saying that in part B, five questions will come. So whatever it may be, it is none of the uh, like uh, basic that it is not at all important for you all. What is important whether you are covering all the lesson summaries is important and textbook grammar is important. You don't need about the question paper. Ma. Why you people are all are concentrating on the question paper. See what I have said in 10th A and 10th B you will get the additional reading lessons questions I have said and some of them are saying that my faculty said that uh, additional reading is not there you need to exclude that whatever it may be if they asked me what you will do whether what you will do you will lose 15 marks right so try to learn additional reading only whether it will come or not you will only get marks right whether I will get marks. So this is the first tip. I, I first thing I need to tell you all. See, oh captain, my captain, hmm? Malikan Srinivasan, Iliasis, and uh, whatever the lessons you are having out of three units. And one more thing, three units only you are having. Some of the students are saying six units we are having. Another three is for fourth semester students, not for third semester. So don't get confused and don't get uh, that type of uh, like tenseness in your uh, mind okay you are confusing yourself and also you are confusing others also so don't need about the question paper whatever it may be try to learn the grammar bits and the summaries okay so what are the summaries you need to uh, give so in part a <clears throat> in section a six questions they will ask in six questions, you need to attempt any four bits or four questions which carries five marks each. Okay, so pronunciation, vocabulary, spelling and grammar, whatever you are having in three units. In each unit, you are having pronunciation, vocabulary, grammar and spelling. So try to learn all the three units, pro pronunciation, grammar, vocabulary and spelling. You will attempt four bits in part a okay so no need of learning if you have learned pronunciation all that means no need to learn any note 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 making or circulars you are having so no need to learn that paragraph expansion notices and circulars note making note taking this type of things you need are excluded see first question will come from pronunciation vocabulary grammar and speaking second third fourth will also sing Fifth question is from note making or note taking. This question will come. Theory question. And sixth question is from notices and circulars and paragraph expansion. So better my suggestion to you all is try to learn three units pronunciation bits, vocabulary bits, grammar bits and spelling bits. This is the four main important 
for section A, you can easily score 20 marks. And coming back to the section B, from 7th question to 10th question, it will be there. Four questions they will ask. Each carries 15 marks. In each question, you will have internal choice. 7A will come from uh, Walt Whitman's O oh, Captain, My Captain lesson. 7B will come from Malika Srinivasan. 8A will come from uh, The Solitary Reaper. And the 8B come from How to Live to be 200. So this is the two questions. Okay. So try to prepare Malikan Srinivasan or Captain or oh, Captain My Captain summary. Any one summary. Okay. And the Solitary Reaper or How to Be Live in 200. This is out of two lessons. You need to prepare any one summary. That will be enough. And coming back to the ninth A will come from uh, like John Keats author john keats wrote that prose right so that lesson it will come from 9a and 9b will come from leo leo tall stills this type of lesson uh will come from out of these two lessons you need to prepare any one summary that will be enough nine questions is enough and coming back to the 10th question you will get additional reading only my, my uh, hope 19 percent 99 percent additional reading question only they will give because they need to cover whole the subject whole the syllabus whatever you are having in your semester three right they're covering textbook Textbook grammar, pronunciation, vocabulary, grammar and spelling. They are covering all the lesson summaries. Then why they will leave additional reading? Why they have given additional reading in the syllabus? This is the basic knowledge you need to think about this. Okay. So additional reading in first unit you are having. In second unit, second lesson, third unit, third lesson. Only three lessons you are having. Right. So try to learn any two lessons uh, additional reading definitely it will be useful to you only whether it will come or not it is secondary ma whether you will attempt or that you should be able to attempt that question which it, because it is having 15 marks why can you use 15 marks if you are not ready if you are not reading and you are going in question paper they have asked from 10th question asked from additional reading what you will do simply you will leave further that 15 marks huh? so don't do like this type of things. So try to learn the summaries, try to learn the textbook grammar and try to learn the additional reading of the two units. Okay. So this is the changed syllabus and the changed question paper where you will get. So don't get confused and uh, whatever it may be the syllabus, uh, whatever the content you are having, context you are having, try to prepare that only. I have done a preparation video. I have done a preparation video as well as the important questions video. Basically, first you should watch the preparation video, paper presentation video. That will be helpful to you score the O grade in this subject. Okay. So how you need to write the summaries, how you need to uh, present the answers or where you need to give the question numbers, everything I have discussed clearly in paper presentation video. It will be there in our channel. So try to check out in our channel. It will be useful to you all okay so tomorrow is only you are having examination don't get confused and don't uh, get tensed okay so try to learn whatever you have learned till here i hope that your preparation has over so whatever you have learned till here try to buy hard that so no need of learning any extra questions or any extra things from the any publications textbook is enough only textbook grammar textbook summaries textbook additional reading is enough to score 18 marks that from that only they will ask the question paper no need to learn for it from any publications any sia publications rahul publications anything okay so this is the thing you need to follow students so i hope that you have clear about this subject and uh, whatever it may be tomorrow your examination is there so try to write the answers try to attempt all the questions uh, what they have asked if they are asked five questions to be attempted you need to attempt that five questions so my suggestion is textbook lessons you need to prepare textbook grammar you need to prepare and additional reading of two lessons is enough okay so this is the three so if you start your preparation now also within five to six hours you will complete your preparation about the english we can't it is an easy subject and generalized subject. Many of the students will easily get passed. But scoring a grade is important in English subject. Okay. So this is all about the video. If you like this video, then like, share and subscribe to our channel and share with all your friends and groups. This will be useful for them also. So don't get confused about the question paper. Be 
study whatever you are having you should be prepared by your own syllabus whatever it may be the question paper in part b whether they ask six questions also you will be able to attempt if you read the summaries and textbook grammar and the additional reading okay so this is all about the video so once again i'm saying don't get confused don't get confused tomorrow is only you are having your examination and all the very best for your examination okay so tomorrow please do comment me in the comment section whether how you got your question paper and how you wrote the answers and uh, everything okay so this is all about the video all the very best for your preparation and the examination if you like this video then like share and subscribe to our channel and share with all your friends and groups this will be helpful for them also See you all in the next video. Bye-bye students. All the very best.